Come on, Nate, we have to go. And where exactly are we going? I don't know. Mom and Dad didn't want us, so now we have to find someone who does. But we're out in the middle of nowhere. Come on. We can't waste very much time out here. <sighs> what was that? Nate? Nate? I'm here, but did you hear that? Yes, come on, we have to hurry. Come on, Nate! <laughs> Ow! Nate, are you okay? Nate? Nate? Oh no, come on Nate, we have to go. Alright Nate, I'll come find you. to get out of here. <sighs> Guys, I found someone. Come here. Quick, go get the bed. On it. Stay with me. Stay with me. Here's the bed. Great. Help me get him up there. Let's go. We have to get him back to camp soon. I don't know how much longer he's going to survive. He's going to be okay. Let's go. Quick, get the nurses. We have a, we found a little boy in the woods. On it. Is he with you? Do we need to send out backup? No, we got him. He's coming. Oh my dog. Please clear the area. I got the nurses. We need to get him to medical help. Now. On it. Let's go. Please move, ma'am. Thank you. Let's go. Thank you for finding him so quickly. If you didn't find him then, he would have died. You're a true hero. I hope he'll be okay. Yeah, me too. But I'm gonna go to the soldier camp. Uh, yeah. Hurry, get the bandages. Here they are. Hurry, he looks like he's bleeding pretty bad. I know. He stopped breathing. We need to hurry. He's okay. He's okay. He'll be okay. Hey, buddy. Um, I know you're asleep right now, and you probably can't hear me, but I just, I not, I can't let you give up. Don't follow the light. Uh. I need you to wake up soon. I really don't think you were alone in that forest. I would like to know some answers. Uh, bye.
Where am I? You're awake. Yeah, but, um, where am I? Right now, you're at Campfire's Hospital. Oh, my head hurts. Yeah, you were pretty rough when me and my troop found you out in the forest. Now, can you tell me about that? Um, yeah, I was, I was out with my sister, and a pack of wolves came, and we ran. That's all I can remember. Sister? So you weren't alone? You're saying you haven't found my sister? No. No, 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 no. Oh. Don't worry, kid. We'll find your sister. Don't even start looking. She's probably dead. It's a pack of wolves. They kill. Don't worry. We'll find her. No, you won't. You don't understand. She's dead. What is your name? Nate. Alright, Nate. I need you to lay back down and go back to sleep. Alright, but you won't find my sister. Is he awake? Yeah, he said he has a sister, and me and my troops are going out right now to go find him. Alright, alright, I'm sorry. It's okay. Just tell everyone we'll be back later. Alright, did he say anything else? Yeah, his say he said his name is Nate, and that they, him and his sister were attacked by a pack of wolves in the forest. I've never heard of wolves in this part of the forest. Me neither. But, I'm gonna head out with my troop. Oh, uh, good luck. Come on, we need to keep looking. Sir, we've been out here for hours, and we haven't seen a thing. Look, we'll search for a little bit longer, and if we can't find anything, we'll go back to camp. Fine. Alright. Jason, you go that way. Kane, you go that way. Jake, go that way. I'll go that way. Let's go. A caller. It must be hers. She's around here somewhere. There you are. Oh no. She might already be gone. I need to get the others. Guys! Come here! I found her! But we need to hurry. She's almost dead. We need her to get her to camp. Now. On it. Go get the nurses. On it. Good. You found her. I've got to hurry and take her to surgery. She's about to die. Here are the bandages. We're gonna need more than bandages. Miss, are you? She's lost way too much blood. She might not make it. Well, we'll try what we can do. Here. Alright, let's try. But she has maybe a 5% of living. There. Now we can only hope that she'll wake up. What happens if she doesn't? Obviously, her body will give up on itself. And... Yeah. But she's in a pretty deep coma, and she lost a lot of blood. So, she has a chance of surviving, but it's very, very little. Yeah. Well, let's go. Look, everyone, I'm okay. Nate, you all right? Is that the little boy you found in the forest? Yeah. I'm okay. I'm alive. I should keep this little bandage on my foot since I hurt my foot really bad in the attack. 
Yeah, well, now that you're okay, we can put you into school. School? What school? You don't know what school is? Um, of course I know what school is. Uh-huh, I'm super excited. Right, well, I'm sure they'll get you settled in for your first day. Yeah, we've got that handled. Well then, let's go to my first day of school! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, slow down, mate. Let's go. Hooray! Come on, Nate. This way. Whoa. This is school? There's so many kids. Yeah, Nate. This is your teacher. Hello there, Nate. Hello, miss. Um, so what exactly do we do here? You just hang out with all of your friends. Here, I'll introduce you to your age group. Come along. Good luck, Nate. I've got some things I need to do. Uh, you better stay here. I'll come get you after school. Alright? Okay, Carly. This way, Nate. Coming. These will be your new friends. Thank you. Hi. Um, hi. Hello. Hi. Alright, kids. Lunchtime. Where am I? Nate? Nate? Ow! Please, somebody help! Oh my doll, you're okay. Are you okay? You shouldn't have gotten out of bed. Where am I? And why does my leg hurt so much? You're at the hospital, and your leg hurts because you broke it, I guess trying to run away from the pack of wolves? At least that's what your brother said. My brother? You have Nate? Ow. Stop trying to stand. You're just going to hurt it more. When can I get out of here? We have to wait till your leg heals enough for you can walk. Then you can get out and stay in the camp, I guess. Or go back from where you came from. I guess we'll just stay in the camp. Why don't you go back to where you came from? I don't really want to talk about it right now. Alright, that's fine. I'll let you get some rest. Two days later. Hey, Izzy. I'm the nurse, and... You're ready to, um... You're healed enough you can leave. Seriously? Great. Um, thank you so much. You're welcome, and you can take the bandages off of your face, but the one on your leg has to stay on there for a while. Alright, thank you. <sighs> there, much better. I'm sorry. Oh, it's, um... Wait. You're awake. You're walking. Yeah, I'm sorry I bumped into you. I'm trying to look for my brother. Right, well, you're not gonna find him in here. This is a soldier camp. You're not really supposed to be in here. I'm sorry. I'm so confused. Don't worry about it. Here, I'll show you where your brother is. Come on. Nate? Is he? Oh, Nate. Oh, Nate, I'm so happy you're, o you're okay. I'm so, so sorry about what happened. No, Sissy, I, I'm glad you're alive. I didn't even know you made it out of there. Until I just... I saw you. <sighs> hey, 
Skyler. Hate on. So, are you feeling better from the findings? Yeah, a lot better actually. I'm glad. Hey. Hey, Nate's at school. Yeah, I know. He told me how much he loves it there. Hey, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later. Alright. I actually better go get him. I'll be right back. Okay. Bye. Hi, Skylar. Hey, I, um, I have something for you. Really? What is it? Here, just follow me. It's, it's right in here. Alright, where is it? Close your eyes. Um, okay. They're closed. Now open them. Oh my dog! My collar! Yeah, I found it right before I found you. But, um... Yeah, I grabbed it so that I thought you might want it. I do. Thank you so much, Skylar. You're flipping lifesaver. Yeah, um, I was wondering, are you doing anything on Friday? No. Why? Maybe you wanna go on a date? Sure. I would love you to. Um, I'll see you later, Skylar. Bye. Yes! Next Friday. Hey, sorry I'm late. No worries. Uh, you ready to order? Yeah, sure. After dinner, they went to Skylar's house. Thanks for dinner. It was really good. Yeah, no problem. I'm glad I could spend the night with you. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. So, does this make you my girlfriend? I don't know. Does it? Yes. Yes, it does. Great. Boyfriend. <laughs> there you are, Skylar. Oh, hey, Don. Don't you hate Don me? I saw you last night with that cat. What? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me, Skylar. I know what you did. Dawn, I'm I'm sorry. You're not sorry. You just want me you're just pretending to want me back. Well guess what, Skylar? I don't want you. I'm breaking up with you. I guess you don't really care though, since you have that cat to just go crying off to. We're done, Skylar. I need to find Izzy. Izzy. Oh, hey, Skylar. Hey, um, can I talk to you in my room? Um, sure. So, what did you want to talk about? I was just wondering if you would, um, maybe... Uh, what's wrong, Skylar? It's Dawn. She's making up a bunch of lies about me. And you. What? Yeah, she's my ex-girlfriend, and she's jealous now that I'm dating you. That's ridiculous. I know. Well, is there any way you could stop her? No. I just wanted to inform you. We'll just let her do what she wants. She'll get over it in a little while. Alright. Well, I, um, I have something to tell you as well. What is it? The reason I was out in the woods with Nate is because me and Nate's parents kicked us out of the house because they didn't want us anymore. So we were trying to find someone else who did. And 
Our parents had neglected us, abused us, and never let us go outside. That's why I didn't really know where I was going. We were just running. Oh my dog, I didn't realize it was that serious. Yeah. I, um... I'm sorry I didn't tell you before. I didn't really know how you would react. But now that we were together, I thought you could understand. And I'm glad that you do. Yes, of course. Thank you, Skylar, for pretty much saving mine and Nate's life. I don't know how I'll ever repay you. How about like this?